my previous films never really have too much of a social context. And this film being so rich in the social context of contemporary Chinese society, uh, I was very determined to turn this into a film. Uh, one of the things that particularly struck, struck, struck me uh, is the fact that there is a very definitive uh, division between the first half and the second half of the film. Uh, the first half is about finding a kidnapped, abducted child uh, by, the, by their biological parents. And the second half is about after you found him and encountering with the foster parent, the adopted mother, who you think is a criminal, uh, and then you see the other side of the story. And then how her life was torn apart by the fact that you retrieve your own biological son and how attached your son is to the new mother, which is a very hard fact to take. And in a story like that, I watched a news documentary and I went to interview the real people. I do not find any villain. And that matches with my philosophy of life and my determination of not having a villain in any of my film because I think in life there is no villain. And, um, and this just fits perfect into what I always wanted to make. And it always throws, it almost also throws the perspective of the audience in a tantrum because you were taken on a journey on the perspective of the protagonist and then you're thrown in the midst of the antagonist by the end of the film. Uh, so I thought that was really interesting. Although I have to declare that even though the film was based in reality uh, and a real story and real characters, there are parts of the film that are fictionalized and uh, um, for dramatic purposes. I think um, what I got out of this film was not much more than what I went into it, to be very honest. I, it confirmed my belief that uh, that there are very, I mean, I'm, I'm a pessimist. Uh, I think that life has a lot of, you know, misfortune uh, for most people. Uh, but I also do not believe in portraying or blaming anybody. So in a sense that this story fits perfect into what I always believed in is that, yes, it's a misfortune to be to be in this world. There are always a lot, of, a lot of really, really unfortunate things, which is exactly what happens to my characters in the movie. But at the same time, they do find solace and they do find comfort in each other. And that if we try to make this world a better place, even though it would not change the world, but it could still give us a certain strength to continue uh, I'll believe that something good might come out of it.